can't be hypocritical about anything he does. He can, go, he can do what he wants. I, did, uh, I used to live in Manchester years ago. I used to do, when everyone did ecstasy, an entire generation just lost their cheekbones. They were like fucking, they were like skeletons moving through the city. You know, they'd, they'd come up to you in town, they'd be like, all right, mate, all right, my name's Tony, all right, fucking say <laughs> Anything 10 inches off the ground became a podium, do you know what I mean? <laughs> you get kids by the traffic light, she's going, when the green man says go, we fucking go. Come on. <laughs> I don't do ecstasy now. I'm not advocating doing it. And be aware, if you do do it, a little bit stays in your head forever. It's weird. <laughs> and then you'll hear a tune, you have a flashback. It's like you're back in the club, you start fucking rushing your tits off. And, <laughs> and house music's everywhere now. So you'll be in the supermarket, you know, just, just chilling with your kids, you know. Completely forgotten you've ever done it. Suddenly, some old school classical coming through the music. Sometimes I feel like for my... <laughs> Your kid's like, what's happening? I'm rushing, I'm rushing. <laughs> Do you want cheese? I want to eat. <laughs> Go and get some vapor and some water. <laughs> and a whistle, get me a whistle. 